Are you on Finance One, Ms. Ober? So the, one of the DOJ bureaucrats is taking the stand, so to speak. I'm sorry, excuse me, what do you say? I said there's no photography in the community. Uh, under what law would I be prohibited oh. from filming? So this is house rules. Please direct that question to the speaker's office. Oh, I need to know more. If you're going to try and censor me, I need to know more, ma'am. Excuse me, we're in the middle of the hearing. Ann, what's the title of that? I'm sorry, I can't find it. This says Department of Justice FY 2018-2019. the law. We what law would I be violating? Can the chairman request censorship? I guess you're going to leave and let me do what I do. So you can look at just <coughs> only what the chairman is requesting. Yeah, we would be okay, I'm not denying the request. Thank you, um, Thank you Mr. Collard. Take care. You know, I don't know what it would take to do that. I certainly don't want to be publishing names of minor children who have been attacked in public or given their address. Yes, see how the yeah. money was spent to see how the money was spent. There's no sense to, to spend a lot of money copying reports either. Questions from the committee on this? Ms. Rice, why should you guys get any money at all if you're pro if you're appealing this ballot selfie law? I mean, that's just a crazy expense of money, isn't it? We uh, are obligated to defend the laws um, that the legislature has passed, and we think that there is a colorable legal argument to be made on the constitutionality of the law. I appreciate the answer, but you did say that you didn't have enough staff to, to do things. Well, I think and there's a general, <clears throat> there's staff to do uh, investigations versus staff to do um, an appellate uh, job, that's a very entirely different kinds of cost and we um, will do the, the supporting of uh, legislation as a, as a routine matter in the office. All right. I don't always like your answers, but I appreciate that you provide them. Okay. All right. Take care. Okay, so what's happened now is that uh, I guess they've called more security to the scene and they're deferring in there a little bit further away from the cameras. 
you be will you be prosecuting me for trying to film this meeting? <laughs> I wouldn't comment on that. <laughs> All right, take care, guys. Hey, Dave. How are you, oh, hi, Mr. Hi. Evans? Burke, Joe. Oh, okay. Hi, Joe. Yeah, it's um, apparently it's a work session. What well, what law prevents the press from photographing well, or filming it? So I beg your pardon. I'm not going to answer that right now. No. No comment. Okay. We can talk off camera. We'll be more than uh, happy to explain. You're not going to be talking off camera unless right. you <laughs> physically take the camera away from okay. me. So. Thanks, Dave. Yeah. All right. So, what happens if I continue filming in there? And what law would I be, vi be violating, if any? So he's motioned a, a rep or somebody. Members can ask questions. Sir, you're being very disruptive to our It's just filming. Are you against freedom of the press? What law would I be violating to be here? Does that make sense? press is press, but when you're asked by, you know, under house rules, the chair has control of the What the chair feels you're doing is disruptive. You were politely asked to leave. Um, and, and I just don't understand your refusal to do so. And if you're not apt enough to take notes and, and uh, articulate what you heard, um, I don't know what kind of press you are, but not very adequate, I would say, under those terms. So what happens to me if I stay? Will you have me arrested? Yeah, no, right yeah. to your left. Well, well, you to talk to you. Hearing, Am I required to leave? They're trying to conduct a hearing. Well, I'm trying to just sit here. How is that a problem? You're using a camera. They don't want to use the phone. Not a public hearing. Am I required to follow House rules? You are required not to use your camera. Why are you, you are. Why are you conducting this meeting in secret in that case if I can't film it? We're interrupting. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in the Please. middle of a hearing. We are not bickering with somebody in the audience, even if he wishes to be argumentative. Please do not engage. We are working on three things that Mr. White is passing out. Thank right. you. I am leaving, yeah. but don't expect it to be fast. So, did you just break the law by removing me? I did not, Dave. You're welcome to stay in the hearing. They just said no filming, no recording, because it's not a public hearing. How can they, how can they ban filming? It's, what authority well, do they have? I don't think it's banning. It's a house rule, and it's, just, it's disruptive to the chair and to the members. If it's not banned, then I can go back in, can't I? It's, it's their rule. It's a house rule, Dave. That's all. It's not a public hearing. You're not being disruptive by being there and taking notes, they just don't want any recording going on. That's all I'm telling you. You know how far this could go in court? I'm just doing what I'm requested to do. Do you always do what? you go back in, Dave. You, they just don't want you to film if they feel it's disruptive. Do you always do what you're requested to do, even if the request is possibly illegal? Uh, it's not an illegal request if it's a house rule. I'm, I work for the general court, so I'm just doing what I'm asked to do. Oh. I work for the representatives, and they ask me to they advise you clearly, and you have it videotaped, okay, that they don't want you to film and be disruptive with the filming. You know, should you should reporters people? allow the government to stop them from filming government meetings? Is, is that the CIA in there? No, sir. No. It's supposed to be a government a, meeting a that the public's session. supposed to be able to document. But it's a work session, and they have a house rule. Yeah, a work session about my money. I'm just explaining what they asked me to do, Dave. <sighs> Just following orders is not an excuse. Should be ashamed, Joe. Dave, I'd talk further with you down in my office if you'd like. I'd be happy to talk to you, but I just don't know why you have to film me every time I want to speak with you. If you don't trust what I'm saying, then you don't have to <laughs> I think what you say here is the public's business. No, it's not. 
Not if it's if this is private business in here. This isn't a public hearing. It's not like a house session. Private. They're discussing a you, state budget in there. I understand that. If it was a public meeting day, we don't think they'd have any problem. Well, they just get to decide which parts I mean, of they have of house rules of their. And this is a procedure that's called a it's called a um, work session, and they have a house rule that applies to it. I, mean, I think you're I think you're on thin ice. And I think I'd the, be more than happy to talk the to you, public will decide. Film every word I say. I'm not going to talk to you without it. Well, guess what? I have a right to privacy too. Uh, yeah, well, yeah, right. when you're at home. <laughs> so, and here. No, not here. And neither do you. Yeah, I, which, which you're saying I think that's I, I think that's just, fair. I can't have yeah. a chat with you about anything because you want to record because I have no privacy. Everything so government officials do right. should. A government official? Yeah, everything government officials do should be. I'm an employee for the general court. You, you don't. You don't. The security of the building, and that's what I'm doing. I'm doing my job. You don't consider yourself a government official? I consider myself a security chief for the general court, an at-will employee doing my job. I said, if you want to speak further, that's fine, but I have privacy as well, and I shouldn't have to discuss everything I do publicly for your audience. Thank you. I'll set stand. A little, a little disappointed in you, Dave. I'm disappointed in you too, Joe.